This video shows the walkthrough to turn spring to summer for the second year. Novice? Herbalist? Come closer. Your heroism during the search for Juliet, the rescue of Gloria, and the battle with Vanessa proved something clearly. You are both ready to be promoted beyond novice and herbalist. Violet, stand in the circle. Violet, you will be charged with maintaining the glamour around the stones and making sure the wellspring is protected. Do you accept these responsibilities? I do. Then step out of the circle. Guardian. Now, novice, enter the circle. Terra, you have grown your connection to the Earth this past year. You will now take on the responsibility that was once your grandmother's before you. You shall be in charge of deciding when it is time for our coven to perform our ritual to turn the season. Do you accept this responsibility? I do. Then step out of the circle, keeper of the wheel. Wait, there's one more. Initiate, enter the circle. You joined us in a moment of great need and showed great bravery in the forest and the battle with Vanessa. You shall now be known as Novice. Wow, I don't know what to say. I never wanted to be a witch, but I thank all of you for welcoming me here. Oh, yay! <laughs> well done. Are you ready to take on your new responsibility as Keeper of the Wheel? Um, yes. I think so. You will now be in charge of determining when the seasons change. You will need to brew Spirit Flame each time we turn the wheel. Sure. No prob. And craft the appropriate incantation for the upcoming season. Got it! Make the right offerings to the Wellspring so that we have enough magic to perform our ritual. Fair enough. And upgrade your wand to be the one to cast the incantation from the altar. And there it is. I knew it couldn't be that easy. <laughs> when you are ready, come to me to begin the turning of the season. Morning, Thomas. Morning. I've been thinking about how Hazel always seemed to know to harvest her crops right before the seasons changed. I always thought she just had a nose for it. But now, I think your coven might have something to do with that. Mm, we might. Yeah, I figured. I don't want to know how. Just give me a heads up before you do whatever it is you do. Don't want my crops to wilt because I didn't get them out of the ground in time. I will, Thomas. I promise. Great to see. Hey, heard you got a fancy new title. Yes, but it means I need a fancy new wand. Well, I can help you there. Check out what's new in my shop. But if you decide to go for it, careful where you point that thing. It's got some oomph. There's deeper secrets to our connection to the Wellspring. It's time for you to learn them. If there's one thing magic's taught me, it's that secrets are kind of never-ending. In order to turn the wheel, the Wellspring demands offerings to build the necessary strength. And before you ask, it chooses random items every year. None of us know why. You sure no one knows why? Not that I know of. When you've satisfied the Wellspring, talk to the High Priestess before you actually turn the wheel. Sounds reasonable. I'm so excited to officially start my duties as Keeper of the Wheel.
Juliet's not doing too well. She's happy for Sebastian, but I know she wishes she could bring her father back too. Death is a much stronger force than any magic. Thomas, you know that seasonal heads up you asked for? Yep, got it. Okay, I'll get my crops harvested. Thanks for letting me know. Are you sure you're ready to turn the wheel? Have you finished all of your tasks and let those who wish to know that the seasons will soon change? Yes, I'm ready. And so we begin the turning of the seasons. Just as our ancestors have done for thousands of years. We say goodbye to the gentle sun of spring. We welcome the golden dawn of summer. We turn the wheel. Well done, Keeper. When it is time, we will repeat this ritual to welcome fall.